So today I'm gonna give you some tips on how to look the best in your engagement photos or your wedding photos. Some really easy beauty tips that will make you feel confident and help you look your best for your photos. So um, my first tip is to switch to water for a week. So cutting out sugary drinks and alcohol and just drinking as much water as you can is really gonna help your skin. Like you can tell I haven't been doing that because I have these guys right now, but switch to water for a week. It'll cut down on some puffiness and also help this area look really great. Um, and it's just good for you in general. Um, number two, is to not worry too much about going over the top with beauty routines. Um, so I'm all about like wear makeup that makes you feel great, do whatever in your routine makes you feel your best, but don't rush out and like get a spray tan and do your eyebrows when you've never done them before and um, you know, get a crazy facial when you've never had one before. Like don't, don't test out anything before a photo shoot or your wedding. Um, if you're gonna try those things, try it way before and know that you like where you go, know that you like how it looks. Um, I've seen too many people like test it last minute and it did not work out so great. So um, like stick to what you know, <laughs> what you know works. Um, so if you're not gonna do, you know, if you're gonna stick to kind of some normal natural makeup type things, um, two tips I have for that are to use some brow powder to fill in your brows because it does frame your face. Those will really help in photos. Um, so don't feel like you have to go out and get microbladed if you haven't done that before. Um, just a little bit of brow powder is really great. Helps your, um, helps your eyebrows stand out in photos. The other tip is to use some kind of light highlighter or like highlighting oil. So I like this one, um, it's called Nukes Oil. It's like a facial oil and it's got some gold, like a little bit of gold sparkly in it, which I like gold sparkly. So I just do a little bit of like boop right there on my cheekbone and then like on my collarbones and a little bit right here. So I like the way it smells and it just makes me feel fancy and it just adds a little bit of like light catching stuff to your face without being over the top. Um, tip number three, my friend Christina Irvin turned me on to these and I'm obsessed. This is a jade facial roller. And what's really cool about these, well, it came with this too. So this one's like a more intense kind of version of the same thing, but it like massages out some of your facial muscles, especially ones that tend to like create wrinkles in your face. Like I <laughs> overdid it doing, trying to like massage these out the other day. And like, I feel like I moved all of my, uh, all of my face muscles around so much that I had like a knot here for a second. I thought it was a pimple, but it wasn't. It was just my face being like, what are you doing to me? But anyway, and then it smoothed out and I was like, whoa, I really do think it got rid of some of those like concerned, it's too sunny on my face kind of wrinkles that you get when you're like, what? So anyway, you just kind of roll the jade roller and massage out some of that tension above your brows. You can do it at night, and like once you do it, you're kind of like obsessed with it. So um, I put it in the freezer one time and tried to give my boyfriend a face massage, and he like freaked out. So you can also do that. Um, all right, so <laughs> jade facial roller, and this thing kind of smooths out some of these muscles, which is nice too. It feels really good when it's frozen. Um, tip number four, if you are doing an engagement session or you're getting married, bear with me. Okay, have sex every day for a week leading up to your shoot. I say this because um, stress is going to get in the way of your relationship as you're leading up to your wedding and your engagement session. Like there's a lot of stress going on. And that's the biggest thing that can show up in the photos is when y'all don't like each other or you're mad at each other. And so make sure you are taking time to connect um, and to connect intimately and connect 
on dates, like leading up to your engagement shoot and your wedding. It's really important and it does like make a difference in the photos at the end too, because ultimately it's not about the photos. It's about y'all's relationship and y'all getting closer and celebrating the connection and the love that you have. So take time to deepen that intimacy and connection too. Um, so there you go. Four beauty tips for your engagement session. Have fun. Thank you.